Not. The goal is to give people hope that there is a path to a fully sustainable global economy, that we are on that path, that we are accelerating that path, and that so long as we don't get complacent about it, it will happen. This was really the beginning of the end of the Tesla bubble. I actually think the company could go bust. Tesla's Model Y is the world's best-selling car, beating out Toyota's RAV4 and its Corolla models. Regarding FSD version 12, it's profound. The rate of improvement is rapid. It might be the biggest asset value appreciation in history when you can do unsupervised full self-driving. I mean, that just sounds like a story stock, uh, autonomous taxi. I mean, can you really balance your checkbook with, you know, sort of pie in the sky predictions like that? If you ask the wrong question, the right answer is impossible. My prediction is that a majority of Tesla's long-term value will be Optimus. And that prediction I'm very confident of. It's very rare a product comes along that is seemingly impossible that experts said would never be made. And this is one of those times. Finally, the future will look like the future. People say like, why'd you make it bulletproof? I'm like, why not? <laughs> Energy storage deployments, the mega pack in particular, reached an all time high in Q1, leading to record profitability for the energy business. This is the machine that builds the machine and the factory is the product. And this building is the most advanced car factory that Earth has ever seen. If you value Tesla as an auto company, this is the wrong framework. If somebody doesn't believe Tesla is going to solve autonomy, I think they should not be an investor in the company. But we will, and we are.